Hey guys, this is Miso. Welcome to my kitchen today where we're going to be doing an Asian beef broccoli. But we're going to be doing it southern style. Actually, I already started this recipe and then I thought, wait a minute, I need to make a video. So I have some of my ingredients in and I'm just going to double up the ingredients since I'm also adding more meat. So take a look at what I've got inside and we're going to just start adding some more. So here I have one fourth cup of uh, soy sauce. I have one fourth cup of brown sugar. And remember there's already a fourth of brown sugar in there and soy sauce. I'm gonna put about three tablespoons of minced garlic. And I'm gonna put my favorite sesame oil. So now I'm putting in one tablespoon but I already had one tablespoon in there. Like I said, I'm just doubling everything. So here I just have some Creole seasoning, and you can even not use this if you don't want to, but just do it to taste. It's a little spicy. So here I have some beef broth, and I'm going to put in one cup of beef broth. And remember, I already had a one cup of beef broth in there already. This is a sirloin roast, and I'm just going to go ahead and cut it up. It is very cold, and so it's firm, and it's, it's easier to cut up that way. I'm just doing a little trim up, getting rid of some of that fat, and uh, I'm just about through here. Let this be as lean as possible. Just going to give it a quick rinse and drain the water off. And now I'm ready to put this down into the pot. So I'm just going to get all of my uh, beef down into the liquid, and it's going to flavor it real good. Okay, getting ready to, to, to let it cook for a few hours. Guys, you know what? I got to be honest here. It's about 1 o'clock at night. I am so tired. I just decided I cannot wait this thing out. I'm going to go to bed, but I'm going to take all this meat up and put it in this container. And in, in effect, it's going to be marinating all night. We'll just make it. It'll be just as good or even maybe better. So I'll get this out and cook it tomorrow. But right now, oh, my bed is cold. Okay, I gotta get this up. So I'm gonna also pour all my juice, all of this liquid, over the meat. Tomorrow I could just start out uh, by putting it right back into the crock pot and letting it cook. Let me clean up these edges, and I'm gonna get this into the fridge. Hey, it's morning, guys, and so I'm getting this out of my full, full, full refrigerator that needs to be cleaned out. And I'm gonna just go ahead, look at that. Look at that meat. So this has been marinating overnight. Ah, looks good already. And I have to tell you, even raw, it smells good. But I'm going to get this down into the crock pot. And I am going to let this begin to cook. Now, I already went and added my broccoli and my carrots. And I chopped up some spring onions, and that's going to go in next. Look at this. So you see where I've just put in the broccoli and the carrots. Okay, now I'm putting in these spring onions, and I'm just going to kind of stir them a little bit just to kind of get them under the liquid. Shut your slow cooker down because you are done. Let's go ahead and get this plated up. Look at this. Mm. Now, I made this plate for Big Daddy. He wants tomatoes in the summertime with just about every meal. So I got him some tomatoes and a crescent roll. But actually, you don't need anything else with this. This is rice and the broccoli, beef, and carrots. It is so good. It's sweet. has a little bit of spiciness. So delicious. Uh, my adult children were over today, and they loved it. Um, my daughter went home and called me back, and she said, Mom, this is probably one of the best dishes you ever made. It's so good. So it is really good, guys, and really easy to make. So try this at home. Your family will love you for it. You'll get some big, big, big thumbs up. Uh, guys, I want to thank you for watching my video. Thank you for stopping by today. You knew that I'd be throwing down. I appreciate you so much. If you like this video, share it wherever you're at on social media. Also, give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate you subscribing. And come back often to see what I'm making. I appreciate you so much. 
Bye-bye.